In this video, we will demonstrate how to create an adhesive coated board and then mount a printed image to the substrate. Mounting is generally a two-step process. In the first step, we will set up the laminator to apply a pressure-sensitive mounting adhesive to foam board. This is frequently referred to as pre-coating a board. No heat is required during this process. First, remove the finger guard from the laminator. The nip roller should be fully opened and stationary. Place your mounting adhesive on the laminator's top supply mandrel. The roll should unwind from the back with the exposed adhesive surface facing you. Begin unwinding the adhesive until you have enough material to lay over the top nip roller. The adhesive should go above the black idler bar and over the nip roller. Do not thread the adhesive under the idler bar in this setup. Next, take a scrap piece of material that is the same thickness as the board you are coating. This scrap material is sometimes referred to as a leader. Use this leader to push the mounting adhesive into the nip rollers. Once the leader and adhesive are in position, lower the top laminator roller until it contacts the leader. Apply additional pressure by rotating the pressure adjustment knob approximately one quarter turn left. The pull rollers should be set to the thickness of your board, in this case 3 sixteenths of an inch. Replace the finger guard on the laminator and position your board on the feed table directly behind the leader. The front edge of the board should touch the back of the leader. Turn on the motor to a slow speed and begin feeding the leader and board through the machine. If the adhesive is not laying down flat, increase tension on the adhesive supply roll by turning the brake mechanism forward or away from you. You can process multiple boards at a time by feeding one directly behind another. Once the boards exit the back of the laminator, use a razor to separate them. You may need to trim any overhanging adhesive from the boards. You now have a pre-coated adhesive board that is protected by a removable liner. After you have pre-coated your boards, cut the mounting adhesive on the laminator before it enters the nip rollers. Remove any remaining material from the laminator. To mount your print to the board, peel back approximately 2 to 4 inches of the adhesive liner from the front edge of the board. Press down and crease the liner to create a small hinge. Position your print on the board. The hinge should allow you to align everything properly until you are ready to mount. Once the print is in place, lightly press down to adhere it to the center of the exposed adhesive. Start in the middle and use your fingers to press down the rest of the leading edge of the print. Place the board on the laminator's feed table and lay the print over the nip rollers so that it is out of the way. Firmly grab the liner hinge and turn on the rollers to a slow speed. The board will begin moving through the laminator. While it is moving, pull back on the liner hinge to remove it and expose the adhesive on the board. The print will mount to the board as it passes through the nip rollers. Once it exits the machine, perform any necessary trimming or post-laminating steps. You now have an